How does cancer develop in the body? Cancer is a complex disease that can develop in various parts of the body. It begins when normal cells undergo genetic changes, called mutations, that allow them to grow and divide in an uncontrolled manner. These mutations can be caused by a combination of genetic factors, environmental factors, lifestyle choices, and chance events. Let's go through the step-by-step -step process of how cancer develops in the body. Initiation, the first step is the initiation of the cancerous process. This occurs when a normal cell sustains DNA damage or genetic mutations. These mutations can be caused by exposure to carcinogens, such as tobacco smoke, certain chemicals, radiation, or even inherited genetic defects. Promotion, once a cell has been initiated, it enters the promotion stage. During this stage, the initiated cell starts to divide and multiply more rapidly than surrounding normal cells. This uncontrolled growth is due to additional genetic mutations that accumulate over time. Promoters can include hormones, inflammation, or other factors that stimulate cell growth. Progression, in the progression stage, the cancer cells continue to accumulate more genetic mutations, allowing them to grow even faster and spread into nearby tissues. These mutations can affect genes that control cell division, DNA repair mechanisms, or cell death, apoptosis. Cancer cells can also acquire the ability to invade blood vessels or lymphatic vessels, facilitating their spread to other parts of the body through the bloodstream or lymphatic system. Angiogenesis, as the tumor grows, it needs a blood supply to provide oxygen and nutrients. To accomplish this, cancer cells induce the formation of new blood vessels, a process called angiogenesis. This allows the tumor to grow larger and invade nearby tissues. Metastasis, in some cases, cancer cells acquire the ability to invade blood vessels or lymphatic vessels, enabling them to spread to distant organs and tissues. This process is known as metastasis. Once cancer cells reach a new location, they can establish secondary tumors, causing further damage and complications. It's important to note that not all cancers follow the same development process, and there can be variations depending on the type and stage of cancer. Additionally, the specific genetic mutations involved can differ between individuals and types of cancer, further complicating the understanding of cancer development. Understanding the detailed mechanisms of cancer development has allowed scientists to develop targeted therapies and prevention strategies that aim to interrupt these processes and improve cancer treatment outcomes. Thanks for watching, please like and share this video. Also hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and let's embark on a journey of knowledge together.